Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be decoding, is that a word? I am not really sure. Senorita. Lately, I have been obsessed with Shawn Mendes and Senorita just came out like a couple weeks ago and it's been playing nonstop in my head and on the radio and on Spotify and whatever. I love it. Before I start this video, I just wanted to say that this is all just a joke and I know there has been rumors about Camilla, 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 I don't know how to pronounce her name, but Camilla and Sean dating. Um, honestly, I don't really know, and considering that they keep denying that they're not dating, or denying that they are dating, I don't really think it's anyone's business that we should know if they're dating or not, if they want their relationship to be private, then I think they should get the respect. If they are or not dating, it doesn't really matter. Let's get into the video. The first lyric or stanza or line, it kind of looks like poetry to me. I guess that's how like songs are written is kind of like poetry. So the first line says, I love it when you call me senorita. So that is Camila saying that. So this, she's like, Sean, I love it when you call me senorita. So maybe that's like an inside joke between them. The next lyric is, I wish I could pretend I didn't need you. That's really funny because in another one of Sean's um, music videos or songs, he says, I can't write one song that's not about you. And now she's saying, I wish I could pretend I didn't need you. I think they need each other. But every touch is ooh la la. When a girl says ooh la la, they're talking about like diamonds or like something pretty like ooh la la, like look at this. She thinks that his touch is like ooh la la, like oh my gosh, look at this gem, like. So pretty much there's no other words to describe his touch. We know what that means, ladies. It's true, la la la. She just confirmed that they're dating. She said it's true. She literally just said it's true, so. Oh, I should be running. Why isn't she running? Does she like, does she need to like be in shape or something? Oh, I should be running. Um, Maybe she's like, jealous that Sean is like really fit and maybe he runs a lot and she like she's like oh I should be running because I need I need to build my body up I need to get more in shape right now Ooh, you keep me coming for you she's like he's so irresistible how ca how would someone not want to be his husband his, his wife I'm sorry. his wife or husband you know you, you never know now Sean starts singing land in Miami. Does Camille live in Miami? Does anyone know? Because maybe he's like going to visit her or something. Maybe she's on vacation in Miami and she's like, hey, can you come? I really need to see you and like talk to you. And this vacation would be so much better if you were here. Land in Miami. The air was hot from summer rain. That seems pretty steamy to me. He's like, he's leading up to something that's really, you know what I mean. Sweat dripping off me. So this is what Camila was talking about. He got off the plane and he was running to see her. He was like running to Miami to find his girl. And now he's sweating, he's sweating so much. And Camila's like, oh, I should be running like so that I can get sweaty so we can like run together. Yeah. Before I even knew her name, la la la. What are you talking about, Sean? You're literally dating her. How could you not know her name? You you just went to visit her in Miami and you don't even know her name? That seems a little sketchy to me. It felt like ooh la la la. So they're on the same page here. They're both like, look at this gem. It's so irresistible. They're on the same page here, which is good because if they weren't, then this relationship would like not work out. Yeah, no. I have no idea what that means. I can't. 
I can't decode that. Yeah, no, that's like a secret language or something. Sapphire Moonlight. I don't even know what that means either. Like, okay, so he's in Miami and it's dark now. And he sees her under this sapphire moonlight. Like, in a distance. And it's like slow motion. He's running to her in slow motion. Because he's obviously a runner. And sweat is dripping off him. We danced for hours in the sand. Okay, so, ladies, if you want to steal Sean's heart, go to Miami, text him, and be like, Hey, are we going dancing later in the sand? Because apparently he really likes to dance. That, that's the vibe that I'm getting from this. Tequila Sunrise. Okay, so first, they were dancing in moonlight, and now it's the sunrise. So they were dancing for like 12 hours while it was dark outside. That's a lot of dancing. No wonder there's sweat dripping off of him. Her body fit right in my hands. She must be really tiny. Or he must have really big hands because... I don't think I could fit someone in my hands. It felt like ooh la la la. Yeah. So, he has the gem. She's the gem. The ooh-la-la. -la. And... It's in his hands right now. So, she is the ooh-la-la. -la. I love it when you call me senorita. Here we go. Now, they're getting up in the world. And she's like, I love it when you call me senorita. Because maybe when they were dancing in the moonlight, he was calling her that. And she's like, oh my god, I love that. God. I wish I could pretend I didn't need you. She needs him, guys. We all know this. She can't resist the gem, ooh la la. And every touch is ooh la la la. I told you, it's just a bunch of ooh la la's. They're all like, oh my gosh, this gem. It's true, la la la. Maybe they should be in the movie La La Land because they're saying la 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 a lot. Whoever directs that movie, um, I think they need a part in La La Land 2. Just, just keep that in mind. Ooh, I should be running. This is Camila again. She's like, he just ran from the plane to Miami and danced with me. He's sweating so much. Like, I should be sweating. So she's gonna go for a run, obviously. Ooh, you know I love it when you call me senorita. Um... You already know what I'm gonna say. I wish it wasn't so beep hard to leave you. We don't cuss on this channel, okay? So pretty much, she's saying like, she's been dancing with him all night. She's having such a fun time and she can't leave, clearly, because they danced from nighttime to morning. She's like obsessed with this guy. That's an obsession thing. Every touch is ooh la la la. You already know what I'm gonna say, so it's true, la la la. They're confirming their relationship in this song, like, it's it's clear. Ooh, I should be running. Camila, you keep saying that you're going to run. Then just do it. Stop saying that you should be running. Just do it. We already know that you should be running at this point. Um, ooh, you keep me coming for you. We know, you've been dancing for like 12 hours by now. Locked in the hotel. Okay, so now they left, they left the beach. They are now in the hotel room. And I think Sean is kidnapping her as they locked the door. And Sean was the one seeing her, or maybe it's her hotel room and she's kidnapping him. Plot twist, there's just some things that never change. Has Sean or Camila always been kidnapping people? Is that what they're trying to say? Some things never change. Maybe he's done that before. Maybe he just kidnaps people all the time. You say we're just friends. Well, they are saying that they're just friends. It's all over the internet. Everyone keeps asking them if they're dating and they keep saying we're just friends. So maybe they're just saying the lyrics to the song. But friends don't know the way you taste, la la la. Friends don't know the way you taste, you know what that means, guys. It's official, they confirmed it. Because friends don't know the way you taste unless you go up to your friends and kiss them every time that you see them, which some people do. It's fine if you do that, that's cool. Um, 
But do you make out with your friends? I don't know. It's Cause you know it's been a long time coming. I think they're talking about the plane ride, like, you wouldn't travel all this way to just see your friend. Don't you let me fall. So maybe they were dancing in the hotel room and she like stepped on his foot and tripped and he caught her because he wasn't gonna let her fall. But if you watch the behind the scenes video of Senorita, Sean does let Camila fall. She falls. She would, they were dancing and she fell. How could Sean do this? Ooh, when your lips undress me. That must have taken a long time. I know that it would take me a long time to undress myself with only my lips. You can't do that with just your lips. So they probably spent a lot of time in the hotel room um, if he was trying to undress her with his lips, which is weird in in my opinion hooked on your tongue okay so what i'm getting from this one is that someone was in their room fishing and the hook got stuck in his tongue so now he has a tongue piercing i did not know that sean had a tongue piercing that's like pretty disappointing how do you kiss someone with a tongue ring Maybe that's why he was only using his lips to undress her, because if he used his tongue, then it would stab her. Yeah. Ooh, love, your kiss is deadly. Well, yeah, it is deadly if he has a hook in his tongue. Like, are you kidding me? That could definitely kill someone. Don't stop, she says. Maybe she likes the hook in his tongue. She's like, don't stop. After she says your kiss is deadly. So, maybe she wants a hole in her tongue, too. I love it when you call me senorita. Okay, we've been over this before. She keeps on running. Every touch is ooh la la, the gem. Uh, they need to stop saying the same things over and over again. Sean is going to get tired. Tired. If Camila keeps repeating the same thing over and over again. So, we're just going to skip over all of this because... We've already read it like four times. All along, I've been coming for you. They've been friends, friends for so long. All along, she's been coming for, she's, she's coming for you, Sean. So you better watch out because she's about to let you have the time of your life. I'm sure of it. And I hope it meant something to you. Oh, I think it did, Camila. Call my name, I'll be coming for you. Okay, so now they know each other's name. At the beginning, they did not know each other's name because he was flying to Miami to see this random girl. He, had, he didn't even know her name. And now he does because it says, call my name, I'll be coming for you. So pretty much they're going to meet up again sometime. Um, we don't know when this is. We've seen a lot of them, like, kissing in public and stuff. Um... So, we don't really know what's going to happen from here. They definitely met up. We know that for sure. They met up for a second time, and they're just coming for each other. So, maybe when he kidnapped her in the hotel, now she's coming for him. She's like, I'm going to kill you, Sean. You kidnapped me and kissed me with a hook in your tongue, and it was so deadly that now I'm coming for you, and I'm going to kill you. So, maybe now she has a hook in her tongue, and now... They're like fighting in their mouth when they're kissing. So like their t their hooks are just like fighting each other. See, now this is smart. Like this makes way more sense than them dating. Come on. I also saw her at one of his concerts. So maybe she's going to fight him. We never know. For you. Ooh, she loves it when I come. That's a little inappropriate, Sean. I think you, um... Moving on. For you. Ooh, I should be running. Sean, can you please teach this girl how to run? She's coming for you, so... If she's walking and she's coming for you, then it might take a while. Ooh, you keep me coming for you. 
she's gonna kill you. That's, that's pretty much what's gonna happen. Um, so I would watch out for that. Just be aware of anything happening. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. This video was way more fun than I actually thought it was going to be. I did not plan any of that and it just kind of like happened. Again, that was all jokes. I respect their privacy and I hope that this video made you laugh in some way because I definitely thought it was really interesting and not what I was expecting to film. If you love this song and love them or them as an individual, comment down below because they're honestly amazing singers and they have gotten so big in the last couple years which is incredible for them and I will see you in my next video.